Hello guys, welcome back to Explore Around Us. Thanks a lot to all of you for supporting me, and helping me to reach 1000 subscribers. So, let's begin the video. In this video, I'm going to tell you about the deepest hole on Earth. The Kola Superdeep Borehole. It is also known as, the well to hell, because locals in the area say that the hole is so deep that you can hear the screams of people being tortured in hell. In this video, I will also show you a recording of these screams but first, let me tell you about its history. It is the result of a scientific drilling project in Russia on Kola Peninsula. They all hope to find out what was going on at such great depths, and most importantly, just find out if they could do it. Drilling began on the 24th of May 1970. By 1979 the project had broken all other world records. Over two decades, they managed to dig more than 12 kilometers down into the earth. The Kola Superdeep borehole is 23 centimeters in diameter and its metal lid is welded. During the hiatus, the scientists and politicians from around the world made visits to the site. However, in 1992 they had to stop drilling because the temperature was more than 260 degrees Celsius, which was far hotter than the scientists predicted it would be. Experts still need to figure out a way to overcome this temperature issue if they want to keep drilling and not destroy all of their equipment in the process. All this drilling wasn't for nothing, though, as some scientific discoveries were made. Locals in the area say the hole is so deep you can hear the screams of people being tortured in hell, hence its nickname, the well to hell. Listen carefully to the recording of these voices coming from this hole. We are not sure about these voices but still, it scares. The researchers also found out there was water at 12 kilometers into Earth's crust despite this previously being thought to be impossible. Another unexpected discovery was a large quantity of hydrogen gas. The mud that flowed out of the hole was described as boiling with hydrogen they also found 24 new types of long dead single-celled organisms and gained access to rocks that were 2.7 billion years old. The project ended in 1995 due to the dissolution of the Soviet Union and the site has since been abandoned. But some curious sightseers still used to visit it. Hope you guys like this video don't forget to subscribe to our channel. 